I wish you'd look at these big oak pieces they got out of the woods back yonder where it tore down and there's probably much more coming than just this little bit right here man that'll make a lot of good furniture at least something good to come out of it look at that root on that tree right there so they still got a lot to cut up I, the Amish must have just patched and never did come back over there to that where you see that blue tarp. All right, thought I'd show you that. Look what I rolled up on. It's got three radiators, people. <laughs> can just feel the horsepower in your chest. Oh, ain't that pretty. A 57 station wagon. Those are definitely race tires on it. That thing is built for the track. Let's take a look at the inside. Look at that. Look at that shifter. I just couldn't I just couldn't ride by without stopping to take a picture of that thing. That thing is gorgeous, people. <laughs> they said when they dynoed it, it made close to a thousand horsepower. That is uh what do you call these things again? Twin turbo. Twin turbo. So that's coming straight off the header. Wow. And that's a supercharger. No, it's turbocharged. Turbocharged, but it has that high. It's low end and it lifts the inner cooler. Okay. And then it blows into here. So it cools the air before it goes in. Before it goes in. And that helps them at that really high-end RPM level to still have horsepower. Well, yeah, turbo is just a heat pump, so you have to get the air cooled back off before you... Anytime you need some fresh air, you create heat. So that big part of the radiator is just to pump cool air. Yeah, that's just for the air guards, and then those are two radiators behind it. Yeah. What are these little things right here? They blow off valves, they release the, the, the charge, and 